I'm Evan Thomason for This Week in Santa Clarita. Right now, the city's in the middle of hosting the Western States Police and Fire Games. And here to talk with us today about that is Jessica Freude from the city's Tourism Bureau. Jessica, thanks for joining us. How are the uh, games going? Thanks for having me. The games are going great. Uh, we had about 5,000 different competitors from across the western half of the United States come here to Santa Clarita this past Saturday, which was uh, June 13th. Um, it's been nonstop ever since. We had a variety of events starting on Sunday, uh, and people have been really enjoying all that the Santa Clarita Valley has to offer, not only the events that they're registered for, uh, but certainly the amenities and attractions that we have to offer here in our community. And you mentioned 5,000 people, and there's a lot of people from out of town that are, you know, patronizing our local restaurants and hotels and retail shops. Absolutely. It, uh, it's going to be a little bit hard to get a reservation at your favorite restaurant this week, we hope. And certainly, as I've been about, I've seen families everywhere really enjoying uh, the shopping that we have to offer, our food, uh, and just really the, the attractions that we have here. Everything from spending some time at Mount Asia and our aquatic center to heading over to Six Flags. And I know that for people out of town that can see this, if they're looking at the website and their commercial, they can go to visit SantaClarita.com to find more information. Where are some of the events clustered? I know that there's Central Park and maybe the sports complex. Yeah, absolutely. Well, this was a big regional effort, actually, um, on behalf of the Western States Games. But here within the city of Santa Clarita, like you mentioned, we have got events going on at Central Park, um, also over at the ice station, um, Paseo Club, things were going on at Bridgeport Park, our trails all over our 30 plus miles of trails we've had time trials we've had a marathon on our streets um, the community center and then even um, private venues like Santa Clarita Studios which is hosting boxing all week long boxing is one of the most heavily anticipated uh, events and certainly the boxing finals we've got uh, different matches taking place all week at Santa Clarita Studios but this Friday night is the main event uh, the boxing finals up at Santa Clarita Studios starting at about 530 and that admission is free to the public so Folks are invited to come on out and enjoy a, a match to be uh, remembered. And for a, a whole list, and there's a lot of events left. I know that, um, well, depending on when people see this, but uh, hockey is going to be at the ice station in Valencia for the next three days throughout the week. Uh, where can people find out what the uh, schedules and locations are? Sure. The event website is, uh, actually, the easiest is just to go to visitsantaclarita.com. We've got a link over to the Western States Police and Fire Games 2009.org website. So if you can't remember that one, Visit Santa Clarita is probably the easiest and a nice, easy link over there. All right. Well, we want to uh, let everybody know that all these events are free and open to the public. You can see them on the website that Jessica mentioned. You can also see the uh, schedule on santacluritacitybriefs.com. For This Week in Santa Clarita, I'm Evan Thomason.